What up, everybody? It's your boy Black Megas trying to make it home safely. Got a stretch to go, but hopefully I'll get in there safely. Um, pray for me, y'all. Riding on a donut is not cool. Um, sounds funny as fuck, too. Uh, hopefully this got put on. wheel properly because I, I guys I don't know I don't know what it is about me or why I draw shit like this but I do and I'm just praying like this is just praying everything's okay because right now is the last thing that I need is car trouble. I don't know what my what what's I don't know. But let me tell you the story before um I get all into that. So I've been waiting three hours to get this car taken care of. Um and uh, I still want to know what the fuck it was that I hit. Because I'm feeling like my car is feeling weird now. Anyway. And it's doing some weird cycling. Do something. It's going to be an interesting night. And it's going to be <laughs> interesting couple of days until I fucking get this car situated. I'm gonna get a car, a tire in the morning. Anyway, I'm delaying myself from the goddamn story because um yeah shit shit was weird so like I said, I've been waiting three hours to get this damn tire uh, taken care of the guy finally decides to call it couldn't have been more than 20 minutes before I started recording this video. That's how fast it takes them to do this shit, by the way. All they need to do is just show the fuck up. Clearly, this guy didn't want to show the fuck up. So he calls me, and this motherfucker is like, um, so what do I need to bring? And I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, you know, to change your tire. Do I need to bring anything? And I'm like, well, no, do you, no, I don't think so. And he's like, you know, do I, you know, do you have a tire? I'm like, well, yeah, put all that shit in the fucking system. What do you mean? Like, do you need to bring anything? I'm, I'm sitting here like confused as fuck, y'all. Like genuinely confused as fuck. Cause I don't know why he's asking me these questions. When you use roadside assistance through your um, insurance you fucking like have to fill out all the shit and then they'll fucking you know put in a request for the driver tell you when the driver's coming all that shit right or at least maybe that's just me um I don't know <laughs> that's how it's supposed to work at least that's how they told me it's supposed to work and yeah, so I fucking did that, and I'm like, yeah, I put that shit in the system. He's like, okay, I just want to know, like, because sometimes you gotta ask that shit. And I'm like, yeah, no, I did that shit three hours ago. He's like, all right, all right, you know. So, you know, do you know how to change a tire, or is it that you just don't want to change your tire? What the fuck? Um, what type of fucking question is that to ask? Like, seriously. Who taught this guy customer service skills? Like, what? What possessed him to think that that was 
that was a cool question to ask. But no, so I snapped. I was like, why the fuck do you think I would call and pay for this shit if I knew how to fucking do it myself? It's all right, cool. Like, you know, I'm on my way. But so then he gets here. You know, are you ready? I'm like, I didn't say anything because I'm like, okay, let me grab this tire out the truck back to get things going. They're like, come on, you're gonna get an education today. I'm like, huh? Yeah, you're gonna sit here and watch me. I'm just like standing there, like, what the fuck ever, dude. And he's like, come on, you aren't you ready? You go, you want to learn how to do this, right? You don't want to be sitting here. You said you were here for three hours. I was calmly so I could. I said, nah, bro, I'm good. Yo, just go ahead and do your thing. Come on, you sure? You know what I mean? Because if you slip on the highway, they ain't going to come help you. Okay. Cool. Do your job. I'm good. So, he, like, puts the thing together. I mean, put the spare on. And it's like, all right, you got the tire, right? Cool. Be blessed. Leaves the, like, fucked up tire on the ground. I had to put it in the trunk, of course. Horrible. Horrible servant. Don't know what the fuck that was all about. Um, I made sure to get as much information as I could so I could report the company and report the driver. <laughs> Although, at this point, I'm just so tired and I'm so angry, like... I haven't eaten all day. I had to cut work short, so I lost money. Just frustrated. It's like, yo, my luck is the weirdest of all. And like I said, I'm fearful like maybe something happened because it hit pretty hard. And I don't know what the fuck I could have hit because it couldn't have been just a curve. Like, I don't think I hit a curve that hard to punch holes is like what curve punches holes in a tire like that so something had to be on the road um not that i was gonna go and like try to seek it out or anything like that like <sighs> just the weirdest of days the weirdest of things um i don't know y'all I just really don't know, and it's bugging me because I was sitting while I was sitting waiting. I was just like thinking, like something really has to start changing. Like I need to figure something, something out. Something has to evolve in my life. Cause I can't keep having these incidents. Like now, I gotta go. You know, lose money by replacing the tire before I, like, should have. Um, and figure things out. Like, this tiresome. This is very, very tiresome. But you know what? It'll be alright. I'm just frustrated in the moment right now because this has been just such. such a disastrous night. And I don't, I, man, that experience with that driver, that blew me. That really blew me right there. I don't know what the fuck that was. Like, I'm just hoping that this spare tire stays on for me to get home and it stays on long enough for me to get to the tire place in the morning. Um, so I can replace it. It's Jesus Christ. Shit is just, oh man, it's wild. But I planned on doing a video about a whole bunch of other stuff, and it ended up being like more of a personal rant. So I apologize to you guys. But it's just been a wild night. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna have a drink, and. Chill out. I need to stop and get something to eat. 
I'm worried something about stopping though. That's the problem, and I need to get over shit. That's the shows you how fucking out of it I am. I'm not even in the right lane to get home properly. Um, I'm just blown right now. It's really, really blown. It's really, really not happy about the event that took place this evening. Um, oh, Lord. Man. Fucking trippy as shit. Shit is trippy, y'all. Anyway, as always, you guys, feel free to hit me up. Let me know what you think. I might do another blog once I calm down. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Anyway, feel free to hit me up. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you later. This is your boy, Black Mix, and I'm out. Deuces.